Hello, I'm uh, it's Austin Buffin again, and today is the 15th anniversary of September 11th. And millennials like me, um, it's very 9/11 is quite a date for us. It's I don't think it's a day any of us will ever forget, but it's also a day a lot of us don't remember because September 11th happened 15 years ago and. I am only 20 years old, meaning when it happened, when the Twin Towers fell, I was only 5 years old. Meaning I do not have my recollection of when it happened. And neither do any of my brothers, nor my girlfriend. September 11th to my generation is basically the making of my world. We'll never know a United States of America that was never in fear, that was not in fear of an attack. We understand that the safety is necessary. We expect it now. Big government with a lot of agents roaming around, searching our luggage is a fact of life that I don't think we could live without. Our freedom is now being protected by many people and is infinitely questionable nowadays, I think, because of what happened. And it's on days like today to think that we should be more together. And it's very disheartening to see that we are not together. Earlier today I watched President Barack Obama's full remarks on the 15th anniversary of September 11th. And over half of the video's comments were attacking him and calling him very mean things on the one day where we should be united as a country in mourning and trying to help each other instead of attacking each other. And even the presidential candidates, Hillary Clinton and Donald Trump, are not. My generation, I don't think, is the divisive parts. And I think we, um, as a people, need to come together more. And my view is shared by almost everyone I encounter. I mean, this divisiveness is a small percentage that is doing a lot of the yelling and I think is hurting America. But just one millennial's take on it.